This is very better homes and gardens -y, but allow me to ask you the question. Want to know how to ensure that your child is an absolute winner at school? Then keep watching for my number one tip. Then later, I'm going to show you how to paint a window. You just open up this paint can. Give it open. Get it. Come on! I'm pretty sure I've cracked the code. I don't think it matters what genetic material you bring to your kid anymore. Your kid could have a secondary head on his right shoulder that isn't very talkative and only ever pipes up when they're walking around the shampoo aisle of the supermarket where it says, Yeah, yeah, head and shoulders. So let's get that brand, Bradley. You can ensure that even that kid's liked. All you have to do is name them. Dimitri. I don't know what it means or where it's from. I couldn't be bothered to look it up on babynames.com. She was hard for the many. She was hard for the many. Yeah. Thanks for subscribing. But I've known three Dimmies in my life and I've talked to a bunch of other people that know of a Dimmie, so I'm probably up to 11 Dimmies at this point. A Dimmies dozen, because we always eat the 12th one. But sneaky, classic Dimmie behavior. Yeah. And unanimously, all of them have been classified as... A champ. Good? The good kind of champion, the kind that's awesome at soccer but wants to change the subject really quickly when you give him compliments about it because he's so used to giving other people props that he just can't handle it. Oh yeah, nah man, I'm not even that good. Like, have you seen Cristiano Ronaldo? Oh yeah. For real, that guy, I swear he's a freak, man. Yeah, well obviously you're not as good as someone who's on a 17 million euro a year contract, but you know, you make it a zone every year. Yeah, but bro, I just do it for the Mappers, man, because like, the others are around near the McDonald's, and if you say you didn't bring a lunch, Mr. Davidson lets you go there, and you can get whatever you want. And then you get to go off at two, man, you should try out, because like, you get to go home early, and relax. He's truly an archangel amongst mere mortals. How awesome is that? And how the nickname sounds like someone hitting a tubbler? Dimmy. Any other teenager who's good at soccer is always trying to show off their pecs during lunch and shouting attention grabbing comments like Yes, pass it! Pass the ball! I'm angry! I'm angry, Harry! Dimmies don't showboat. The only reason they even try out for zone is because Good food with good mats? Hey, Raj, should we get a 20 pack of nuggets? Can you handle that shit today? Didn't you learn a lot from the Dimmy, you know? He was always showing slightly bettering tidbits of information. It was like having a secondary teacher in the class. Wait, Tom, my man, put your fingers like this. Alright, hang on, let me just put that in there. What do you see, man? Oh, what? It's a veg! Yeah, yeah, you did! My brother showed me last night. Hectic, Don't you reckon stretching back at your chair is always a Dibby's way of indicating? So you get for the day, boys. It's just always up for whatever's going on and pretend they're not and mock him, Peter. Like, I bet their grandfather at home always asks them. Dimmy, come play chess with your dish. Play with yourself, granddad? Nah, but do it in your own time, not around us. <laughs> and then they'll go on and actually play chess with their granddad. So nice. Now, this is only a theory, but it must have something to do with the fact that if you're 12, watching WWE without a shirt on at midday, and wearing nothing but track pants, and your mum walking in to say, Do you mean the crust that I am thinking for hungry for snack? And you responded with a barely conscious, Yes. That combined with the name Dimmy, and if you ever ask them if they like Space Jam as a kid, they'd probably respond with, Yeah, man, Space Jam was this. <laughs> must congeal to make you a natural urban bound. Hang. You know if you're a doctor or a lawyer or something that Australia needs to get priority on the citizenship listings? Can we please put Dimmies on that list? If you have a counter example of a Dimmie that's not a champ, put it in the comments box, but otherwise, let's not even screen these people. Just show us your photo ID and you're instantly a citizen. Make your country a giant nightclub for me. Second, if you think there's a name that guarantees you're going to be a champ, tell us about it and we'll put the most agreed upon on the Friendly Geordie's Facebook page. But be warned, the person you have in mind must be at least as much of a king as Friendly Geordie's subscriber Horn. Flood. Look at this guy's mane. Concrete jungle lion. I have more of a legitimate claim to pride rock than Simba. Think of that guy when you suggest your name. And if that person doesn't stack up to Horn Flan, then don't waste our time. We're not interested. We're looking for the best. Horn Flan already gets a position on the Friendly Geordie's Facebook Hall of Fame as the constitutional monarch of the page. Which means we, constitutionally speaking, should get Horn Flan's permission to post anything up on the page from now on. But yeah, if you don't like our position from now on, take it up with Horn Flan because he's technically the monarch of the page. Does your friends challenge my excellency? So much business at the front. Loosest party ever at the back. Please press the subscribe button now. Come on.